Sonia! You were too late, Rauru. You took for granted the godlike power you had in your hands. Do you now see the potential you squandered? As for her, she is merely the first victim of your arrogance. You tried to control me, Rauru, and you will die knowing that you failed. And it's gone! Prince Sonia needs you! <laughs> Matt Mercer was able to finally do an evil laugh. <laughs> As I was, was kind of wondering, I was like, when am I ever going to hear Matt Mercer as actual Ganondorf, <laughs> except for the beginning? <laughs> like, okay, there we go. I hear a little bit of more Ganondorf. Cool. Hopefully we'll hear more lines. It would be it would suck for them to like get Matt Mercer in their in, in like a Nintendo game. Him play such an iconic character, which is Ganon, but not say a lot. <laughs> that would suck. Oh, that would be terrible. It's like, oh, what a waste of talent. Uh oh. Uh oh. Bloodman. Get out of here. Oh, and if there's a blood moon, I can't go that way anymore. Because <laughs> that, that freaking creature is going to come back. Huh. Hopefully I'm out of range. <laughs> I think I am. I should be. When the glow of the blood-stained moon shines. I just like, uh, there was this video of this girl <laughs> pretty much saying, like, when you played too much, like, Tears of the Kingdom, and you're, like, in the middle of the story, <laughs> quoting Zelda. <laughs> it was like, when the glow of the bloodstained moon. <laughs> That's all I can think of now. Oh, and I should maybe be able to... I don't know if I probably need another piece of this gear, maybe. Let's see. I don't know if I'm able to do it. Yeah, I'm able to kind of do it. I don't know. Nah, I think I need the full set. So, sadly, this, um, oh, wait a minute. Do I have a spring? Yeah, I don't need to climb it. Also, there's a Korok over there, but he can fucking wait. Hmm. Making sure everything is, uh, done their thing, but, uh, what I was going to do, it's like we have a fan. Do I have a spring? Oh, I do have a spring. Yeah, let's just use a spring, man. Oh. Oh, god damn it. Oh, okay, cool. I didn't waste it. I don't think I wasted it. What I wanted to do... Get off. <laughs> I want to drop this. Oh. No. Ow. Ow. Bring it over here. When in doubt, spank it out. There we go. Who needs to climb when you can just 
Pokemon can use their ingenuity. Let's get a little bit more protection on us. Ah. Sweet. We Caroline. Bah, bah, bah. Mallet smash. Uh, I get what they're wanting me to do. Okay. Well, you guys know what to do. Technically, the angle is a little off. Oh god, the angle is really off. The hell did you do? I wonder if I can... I guess I don't have to make it perfect, perfect. As long as it's like... Okay, cool. It'll do that. And then put a rocket to it. I mean, come on, why would you, why wouldn't you? I really wish, God's sakes. <laughs> Here, do that. Oh, dang it. It's because I'm using a two-handed fucking... <laughs> Well, while I'm waiting for that, I guess I should drop some things of what I would like to put on weapons. Maybe I would like to put that down. I would like to put this down, and I would like to put this down. So that's three things to put down. Okay, so I'm going to put this spear... Make that into that. And then I'm going to use this one to put that into that. And then use this one and turn that into that. Ta da! Let's try that again. And hopefully, not break the fucking log this time. I'm just like bound to break the log every fucking time. How about we don't, Link? Cool. So. What am I doing? Let's see. What is the angle of that? It looks like all I need to do is just put a rocket on, uh, like right on the front, like tip of the. Is this what I'm gonna do? Is it that simple? Is it this simple? And then all you have to do is put it right on the tip. That's what she said. And then, voila! Oh, it's too... Oh, is it actually too much? Oh! Huh. It's too much. Uh, how do we reset? Oh, yeah. Okay. Unstick. I think I need to reset that bad boy. Oh, 
I mean, it's a really shitty mallet, but it'll do. <laughs> hey, it hit bullseye. <laughs> a little cock cocked, but uh. I know what to do with this. Mm -hmm. No, I'll do that. I probably don't even need. Yeah, I probably don't even need the second one. Let's do this. <laughs> I was thinking of combining them, but I probably don't need to even combine them to get the chest. Ooh, hello. Makes up for my fucking bows breaking. Hey, yo. See, I got six points in. Just need another two, and we're golden. Also, that's another tier down. <sighs> Birth of the Demon King. That's number. That's ten. <laughs> number ten. Mm, we got Hudson. We got how many more pens have I found lately? One, two. Looks like I have two more pen missions. Let's do. Let's do this one since it's probably the oldest one I found. It probably is one of the oldest ones. By the time I stream next time, I should have a lot more shrines done, hopefully. And I should have a lot more rock seats. <laughs> so by the time we stream next time, there's going to be a lot done. I really hope so. I hope that's the case. All right. So, I just heard a rumor from the princess riding a mountainous beast with brutal tusks. Hmm, these sightings come all over, but it seems to happen more in the subtropical region in the south. Subtropical region in the south. You may learn the truth behind these rumors at various stables. Oh, okay, so this is a kind of an ongoing one. So never mind on that. Oh, maybe this one will uh, get a little closer to that. Uh, I mean, I guess we have to just keep. Wonder if there's a couple stables down in the south that we're probably gonna have to maybe clear that one up. It'll probably have to be the case. <laughs> I think for the sake of exploration, though, I should probably start going on a journey down south. Alright, so is he waiting on me to do something? I gotta figure out which one is this. He's worried about a regular guest. Where do you arrive? He apparently had an appointment with them where they were going to share a recipe when trying to press. Oh, yeah, isn't this, uh, isn't there just a dude over here? Oh, this weapon's not combined with anything yet. 
Let's see. Is that a two-handed one, too? That's a two-hander, so... I'm thinking... We, uh... Oh. Don't have my regular... I could probably do this. Not with that weapon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, because I bought three of them. <laughs> I was like, hey, a minute. Let's see. I'm going to try to shoot those. I got two of those. Maybe, maybe just do that. <laughs> try and use up some of those black bacoblins materials. That looks like it will fucking hurt up. <laughs> That looks wickedly over, like, messed up. Looks like my weakest weapons are in the 20s now. No longer have to worry about silly or underpowered weapons. Did we discover this? I'm going to make sure. I have a feeling we haven't gone down in here. There's something about it. Something's telling me. It's like, hey, you haven't done this yet. Hmm. Is there something hidden? So it seems a little odd that there's actually nothing down here. Rusty Halber and a sword. I wonder if I have to build something here. Maybe it's a Korok area. I have a feeling it could be a Korok thing. It's weird that there's just a little well with nothing in it. <laughs> I mean, that's technically what a well would have, but yeah. Oh. Legendary sword. Defeat the monster. You guys been smoking too much pot. Yeah, I've heard that one. Okay. Okay. Well, if they were supposed to cross that bridge, there's a possibility that they have been caught up in the woods somewhere. I'm going to cross the bridge first and see if uh, we can come across the his friends. Shall be the case. Supposed to be tents too. They all have tents. Oh shit! Look, it's our dear friend. Oh, one second. Where did that come from? Ah.
Oh, I think that's them. I heard something. Oh, did you guys get hurt? Aww. Or did you guys eat something bad? Don't improvise. Aww. Who suggested who said monster meat? Oh no, monster meat. Mm. Animal meat, right? Maybe or did they all get food poisoning? Always follow the recipe. I mean, that's that's definitely a thing when it comes to baking, but when it comes to actual cooking and all that, you usually have room, you have a lot of room to improvise. So Princess Zelda's meat and rice bowl. Okay, combine plain raw meat, helium rice, and rock salt. Was that all? Raw meat, helium rice, rock salt. I guess I'll cook it. <laughs> so, let's see. Raw meat. Let's get the raw meat first. I guess it could be any type of raw meat. Well, raw meat. Old. Helium rice. And rock sutil. Easy peasy. Oh, but it needs. Ah, oh, shit. I forgot about the. Oh, I totally forgot you can change from near to far. Um. Quit. Uh. Since it's rain, I gotta wait until it stops raining. Ah, oh, the fuck. So I don't think I can light that fire until it's done. <sighs> it's always raining when I don't want it to. <laughs> it's always fucking raining when I don't want it to rain. Like, man, this should be like rain, the inconvenience of Hyrule. And that's why they call it Tears of the King. <laughs> Fucking raining all the time. <laughs> See, to, to, to be honest, though, I wouldn't mind if it rained as much as it does in Hyrule as it would in freaking Colorado. Colorado needs that freaking weather. All right, let's do that again. Rice and then raw meat. <laughs> meat and rice bowl. I've never done that. Aww. Hand over the mail. Oh, do I need to cook it like three times? Okay, I don't have to cook it like three more times. <laughs> I was like worried, like, am I gonna have to like use up a lot of my shit? No. I was like, okay, they only have to have me cook it once. Thank God. So I like how they're gourmets, but they don't know how to fucking cook. I guess that's I don't know. I guess there are certain like food critics out there that don't actually know how to cook a meal, which I don't. I, don't know, I, I guess it's just my kind of thing but you know how like there are people that will review games or watch movies but don't actually play a lot of games or watch a lot of movies but they review movies or play game watch you know, review games too 
I guess there's kind of that where people can review food and not know how to cook or know the intricacies of actual flavor. Aww. I don't know. I guess there are that. There are those things. <laughs> His prior day was a substitute monster parts, and the why would you do that? That's just that just turns into dubious food, which I have not made in the game yet. Uh. or you know, unknown substance. <laughs> ah. So they did some uh, they said trying to do some culinary expansion, and they fucking failed at it. Ah. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, he gave me raw gourmet meat. Thank you. I just used regular ass meat. <laughs> He gave me everything else except that he great upgraded my meat. Ah. Trust me, I need to go back there anyway. Or maybe not. He'll just fly towards me. He'll fly where I where I am. Oh. I never noticed the map on his hip. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, we've done seven cases together now. Hmm. Oh. Well, that's cool and everything. Sapa! A little bit of my money back. That doesn't hurt. Okay, so that's pretty much all of the, pretty much all the ones that I know of so far when it comes to the pen missions. I guess I could do more of this. I'm, I also need to figure out what time it is right now. Four forty-two. <sighs> Is there a quick one I can do? <laughs> I don't know if there's a quick one. Let's see. Messages from the ancient era. I could... Wait, what is this? To become clear in the 13 stone tablets to discover the age of legends by deciphering all of them, one could learn... Couches... Oh, this is, yeah, this is Lookout Point. Let's see if this is a quick one. I just gotta see if uh, this is another somewhat long-term mission I can do, like kind of off stream for a little bit, but try not to finish it until we're on stream. So that way I just have more Zelda. <laughs> More Zelda for the weekend, just for me and me alone. I'm pretty sure everyone's all Zelda Zelda out by now. Just waiting, for, you know, waiting for everyone's playthroughs to be finished and shit. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh. Isn't there... Because all I have to do is, like, t what, take the photo of it, right?
Uh, I mean, there's one. I'm wondering if the one and lookout, the lookout point will be lookout landing counts, or do you have to find one that they're currently trying not to, you know, they're currently not focusing on right now? So that is a thing. I'll take a photo of it. And um, see if uh, see if he'll do anything. Cause there's only one side to this, right? I'll take a closer one too. Just in case it wasn't too close. Wasn't close enough. So I don't know if that one counts though. Boom, blimp, blimp. Or I'm kind of wondering if I should take a photo of one that's right here. Because I think if I'm correct, there might be one. There might actually be one within this structure over here. The ringed runes. Runes. Mm -hmm. Let's see if he, uh, we have any photos to actually send him. We probably wasted our time, though. Look how the chickens are on guard. Oh. According to the stone tiles that are a look at point. Oh. Uh, maybe we've already registered that one? I don't know. I'm kind of wondering if there is one up there somewhere. I don't know though. Right, that one's gonna have to wait. Mm, Cause I don't know the absolute solution to it. Mm, the beast and the princess. That one's apparently gonna have to wait cause uh, apparently further south than me. And let's see, potential princess sightings. Yeah, we've been working on that one. So this and N is kind of connected. It's pretty much connected to each other. Then we have team up oh, that the whole thing there. That's a long term one or some semi long term. So we have the village. Oh, so that's all the side quests. Absence. Hmm. Fine Princess Zona. We only got seven more geoglyphs. Should probably try and uh, kind of pinpoint some of the geoglyphs that I haven't found yet. Regional phenomenon. Only got two more of those as well. So side venture stuff. And then we have apparently whatever that is. Um we have village attacked by pirates. We have... I guess I could hunt myself a Hinox. Wouldn't hurt. We could do that before I end the stream. That way, that way we can see what happens when we, uh... You know, complete a bounty mission. Are we gonna just get paid well, or is it just a good way to find Henoxes and all kinds of other monsters? Do we get like a reputation for hunting the big bad guys? It's probably just a really good way to like pinpoint certain monsters and um, getting their materials. So in case I like, in case I need a lot of Henox like materials, I can pinpoint them. Oh, it looks like I'm about to hit that thing.
That'd be funny if that was <laughs> that big bulbous thing. I was like, no, nope, that looks like water. Apparently there's a glide suit that you can eventually get to that will help you maneuver a lot better in the sky. So that would be nice when you're skydiving. Oh shit, I see him. This is a regular Hinox. I thought they were going to give me like a, a black or gray one. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty much already dead. Yeah, that was way too easy. I thought they were going to give me a hard he nuts. <laughs> okay. I'm not complaining. Nice horn. Mini, 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 mini. Right. Let's go back to look at learning. <laughs> oh, got some gray clouds in the sky. Got some gray clouds in the sky, yeah. <sighs> All right. I guess I need to talk to Mr. Bounty Blood. I did my gerb. no biggie. All I have to do is shoot in the eye and stab it in the dick. <laughs> ah, so you get paid a nice hundo. Oh. And you also get the monster parts for killing a monster, so I guess that's a thing. And you complete that. So, when you... When you kill a Hinox, oh, okay, oh, okay, I guess, oh, I guess they're not, maybe they're not repeating, or maybe we have to wait until another, like, blood moon. Oh. Mm. Okay, so I guess the little bounty boards are not assistant. Mm. Ooh, actually, well, I'll do one more, one more stamina. Because so I think this might be just enough stamina for me to capture that one. I was wanting, I was really wanting to do this on stream and not have to wait until Monday to do it. But in, just in case though, I might have to wait until Monday. But there's one horse I really want to capture because I think it will fit me. It will fit me. I'll probably, ride, I'll probably ride this horse throughout the whole entire stream. The rest of the stream. <laughs> so, I mean the... Well, playthrough. Tears of, Tears of Kingdom playthrough. So. 
Unless there's a better horse. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think there's a better horse for me. Other than, like, I guess Princess Zelda's golden horse. But I'm not very keen on the look of her horse. It's like, it's cool that I collected it. We're taking care of the horse now. But... Kind of rather have uh, something else, you know? Um, I should be changing my clothes real quickly. Technically, we need to go this route. And I should probably just uh, put a little symbol there so I know where I'm going. <laughs> Woo! Also, still have a little bit of that extra stamina too, so that that would probably help. Oh, that's not our dogs. Oh, now that's our dogs. raining too so this is perfect So apparently this is Ganondorf's horse. <laughs> and now I need to find a stable. Oh shit. I don't think there's a stable nearby. Where's the closest stable? Fuck. <laughs> Alright, so I'm not ending the stream until I get over here. I just got a fucking Ganondorf's horse. <laughs> Fuck you, wizard. There we go. Damn, this fucking horse is huge. I don't know. I'm kind of wondering if uh, Mega has this horse yet. No, no, shit, horse, come back here. We can't let this horse run. We can't let this. I don't know if this horse can die, but we can't let this horse not be unregistered because if we if it gets unregistered we're gonna have to capture it again at least we know we can capture it well i think by the time we get to the uh the stables and we register ganon's horse we'll have a full bond probably I have a feeling the temperament is chaotic as fuck. There we go. It doesn't want to sprint, I notice. I wonder if it doesn't sprint because uh, we don't have a bridle on it. I mean, technically you should... You no, know, he doesn't, he doesn't want to sprint. I'm kind of wondering if he sprints. Oh shit! 
kind of wondering if he sprints when you uh, eventually fully have a full bond on him and everything and you register him. I hope you can register him. He's a big horse and everything, but like I'm building a bond with him. Dang it, horse. He's so big, he doesn't know where to go. <laughs> He's a cool looking horse and all that stuff, but he better be easy to tame once I get... <laughs> See, he's, he's still a little... There, there must be a sense... Well, due to the fact since he's Ganon's horse, it's probably going to take a while to really bond with the horse of my... The horse of my enemy. <laughs> the horse of my enemy probably fucking hates me. Watch, we can never really truly tame <laughs> Ganon's horse. I don't even know if there's a name for Ganon's horse. Did, did Ganon's horse ever have a name? Because if it does have a name, we're going to have to name it that. I'm probably going to have to look it up. Uh, okay, let's follow this. Yeah, pretty much just stay on this road. Oh, we're going to have to go past that fort, though. Shit. Unless there's a... You know, I never went down south. I'm kind of wondering if there's a stable down south. Let's go around the lake southwise. I'm kind of wondering if there's a stable... Oh, there probably is a stable up there. That might be the stable I need. And also, we can get another pen mission. Because uh, I know I haven't found all the stables. Definitely not. There's a couple stables probably going to be near the Gerudo Valley and stuff like that. That is not a stable. So this is Vince's quest to tame Ganondorf's horse. I'm trying my best here. Oh, someone needs help. Wait, is it running away? What does it do? Oh, okay. So I say I. It better not be running away after all that effort. I don't think it's running away. I think it's just getting out of harm's way. Oh, uh, wasn't going to reward me for helping him. <laughs> I require a reward. All right, buddy. Come on. Let's get you back to where I want you to go. And yes, we have seen that there is a uh, Korok. And that motherfucker can wait. He can wait a little bit. He can wait a little bit longer. I am wondering how long it's going to take to, like, ease this horse. So we don't have a name for him. I guess we can call him our by his, our nemesis name if there's actually no official name oh for Ganon's horse <laughs> how big that motherfucker is man <laughs> isn't it like almost the size of a Clydesdale but like maybe he's about two is he like two times the size of a Clydesdale Cause god damn like Clydesdale themselves are big I don't know if they're that fucking big <laughs> <laughs> This is wild to see it. It's just fucking wild. 
to see it, you know? So I have a very, I have a weird feeling I might have to kill all the enemies within uh, a fort again. I need to reach my friend. Go fuck yourself. Friend's dead. Oh god, I thought the game was gonna freeze there for a second. Oh, they don't have. Oh no! Oh shit! It didn't load in. That's why. <laughs> it didn't load in. That's why. We're just trying to get this horse to safety and hopefully, hopefully registered. Hmm. What a mane to grab on though. <laughs> there's, there's so much of it. Man, imagine seeing that giant of a horse running at you. Like, holy fuck. Well, that's cool. So I'm proud of myself. I have done so much today. Tears of the Kingdom. It's good shit, man. Including wrapping up the stream by taming this motherfucker. Now I just gotta figure out if Ganon's Dwarf Horse actually had a name or not. Oh, Whoa, what a splendid horse. Do you want to register? That's all you have to say about the horse? Dude, look at the motherfucker. <laughs> Are you kidding? You even bored him? <laughs> yes, yeah, so we have to let a horse go. Whoop de doo. I gotta figure out what horse I'm gonna let go. Probably. Maybe Cobble. Because Cap is alright. I might have to let go of Cobble. Or maybe Chalk. Maybe Chocolate. Well, Chocolate has a belt. The same thing. Only chocolate. Because Cobble has the whole hair in front of the. Yeah, he's kind of more unique looking. Chocolate's just kind of brown. Yeah, let's get rid of. Let's set chocolate free. <sighs> oh! Oh, we're almost fully, uh... Wait, no stamina and no pool. Complete and utter wild amount of strength. And his speed's too, though. So even though he's a unique horse, he might... I guess he's, like, a really good, like, war horse. But he's not really good for traveling, which I kind of started to realize. <laughs> oh. So let's see, let's see if Ganon's horse had a name. So let's see, Legend of Zelda. I'm just gonna do Legend of Zelda. Legend of Zelda. Ganon. Ganon's horse name. I'm trying to remember if his horse had a name. The manual of the Zelda just uh, refers to Ganon's steed as Phantom. I guess that will work. Phantom it is. Whoa. A lot of the uh, Zelda fans that will probably come to this channel one day, see me ride this thing. It's like, yep, that's uh, that's Sam's on point. <laughs> yeah, you know your lord. It's called Google. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've heard. Any of them. I don't even know if they even referred to his horse. Technically, his horse would have red eyes, but um, I think red eyes, but yeah. I'm gonna call it Phantom, though. Phantom, Phantom, one a Phantom. Man. Um, I was about to go over there and just press the Phantom thing, but nah. Cool. 
Uh, I'm gonna board him. I might ride him into battle one day, though. Oh. As I was saying, can your stable even board that horse? Do you even know the fathom of how big that motherfucker is? <laughs> Well, I did the thing I wanted to do when it came to pretty much a whole day today. I've been kind of thinking about it. I was like, I don't know if I have enough stamina to capture Ganon's horse. And now that I did, I have nothing else to do today except for, oh, I guess go back here and try and figure out what our next uh, route's going to be. I have a feeling since especially for those watching the VODs and all that on YouTube what I'm going to probably try and do I'll wait for a second <laughs> until this is all loaded up and ready to go okay okie dokie huh. so strategy plan strategize um I guess we'll help out these guys first on Monday so that will be our first and first and foremost thing to do so when it comes to me doing off stream stuff I can tackle any other Koroks and shrines in central Hyrule which I don't think there are any more shrines but there's probably a lot more Korok and probably a couple more shrines within Hebra or Hebra. I'm gonna say Hebra. So I'll probably do cleanup work in this region, and then I'll try and do cleanup work in Elden. And um, yeah, there's probably a lot more shrines and all that there. So at first, I'm gonna try and at least find all the shrines, and um, then I don't know if I'm. If I still have more spare time and if I'm not doing Korok stuff, I'll probably do some of them off stream. So, because we're just, just so many shrines. And then, of course, I'll try and uh, tackle this place since I don't think there's any major storylines here. So, there's, there's just a few things I can't do. And that's this area. I can't do anything here. So... This is off limits until we get back to the main story. And Ger Gerudo is off limits. So that's the only places I'm not going to be doing explorations and stuff like that. Oh, yeah. And I guess Faron. So that's all off limits. But Nakluda and. And yeah, little areas like here and all that are totally okay for me to explore now. So, yeah, the rest of the map, I'm going to try and find the shrines and stuff like that and everything. I, oh, yeah. And, of course, the depths are off limits until I finish, uh, you know, some of this stuff. Yeah, missions and things like that. And I'll try and do exploration of... I don't know. Maybe I can do a little bit of exploration of depths, but I probably should save a lot of the mysteries of the depths on stream. So, I think, if anything, there's going to probably be a time and place to do depths um, exploration. So, if we do a stream on either Tuesday or Thursday next week, um, we'll definitely do some uh, depths exploration. So, that way, uh, we'll, we'll be all good to go and all that stuff. So, I think that's the strategy plan. That's how we're going to try and tackle it as much as we can. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this stream and everything. And for all you watching in the archives, I should be back. And uh, all that busy work should be all caught up. And there may be a few new weapons here and there. Mainly because, you know, these are going to break. <laughs> while I'm trying to explore and do like shrines and uh, Korok hunting. God, Korok hunting. <laughs>